What is it? We got ourselves a new prisoner. Not just any prisoner. Now don't give the sheriff any lip. He won't tolerate it. My God, it's him. Ain't nobody held Bill Buckman in jail for longer than 24 hours. Incarcerated four times. He escaped four times. I'll tell you to walk, boy. You walk. Now walk! here. Get ready boys. We got ourselves escape artist Bill Buckman. You all be ready to lose your jobs in about 24 hours. Don't worry, Buckman. You'll adjust. You see, no one escapes a rotary jail, especially you. I get a pretty little raise out of this, and I tend on keeping it. You hear me, Weasel? I suggest you don't play deaf with me, boy. I'll make that hearing loss permanent. Tommy, come over here and show him. Wait. I understand. That's more like it. Let's get you dressed. Buckman, this heavily guarded door, it's always locked. Once you're in, you're in. You're not getting out. Rotate! This crank right here rotates the entire jail. Every hour we'll rotate the jail. Make sure you're in there. And here, the unpunished get punished. You've skipped on your time far too long. It's the last thing I do, I'm gonna make sure you don't get out of here.
would stay, Buckman. Do you like your fingers? What? Do you like your fingers? Um, I suppose I do. Then you ought to let go of those bars, son. When that thing rotates, it'll take your fingers. But where's your arm clean off? Name's Tucker. You call me Buckman. Yeah. Believe me, I already know. Everybody knows you. But you only give us one bed, huh? Yeah, unfortunately. If I lay down a while? Go ahead. Buckman. Yeah? You might as well get comfortable. Here at the old Rotary Jail, nobody ever escapes. They just flat out do their time. Yeah, well, we'll see about that. Buckman! Bucky Bucky! Yeah? <laughs> Who the hell is it? <laughs> you wonder who this is? You don't know who it is, boy. Who is it? <laughs> wonder who this is? Well, it's hard to say. From here, you sound like a jackass. But I've known a lot of jackasses in my life, so you can be damn near anyone. <laughs> Hey. Great. Oh yeah, Buckman. It's me. While we're both in here in these cells rotting together, I'm gonna make your life a living hell. <laughs> Why don't that boy like you? Pete had himself a real nice gal. And she was real pretty and all. What then? You stole her? Well, I did say had. Hey! Don't ignore me, Buckman! It's about time you pay for all the evil you've done! Look, Pete. There ain't nothing that fine gal of yours can do for you or me now that both of us is in here, so get over it. Besides, don't forget, that night you came after me with a baseball bat, I hurt my foot running through them woods. So don't think me or my foot Forgive you. Forget your foot. You still mad about that? You still mad about Linda? Hell yeah, I am. Well, then hell yeah, I'm still mad about my foot. Well, I'm going to do a whole lot more and chase you down when I get a hold of you, Buckman. You don't think people know what you did? Well, I do. And I'm going to make your life a living hell. What stories? A horror story. I know what you did to go to jail in the first place. Well, you and everybody else as a part of a gang. And what did you do, huh? I burned down a building. The boss's orders. Got caught. And you did a whole lot more than just burn down a building, didn't you, Mr. Buckman? Yeah, you let a match to some boy 19 years young and let it burn. Crack him, crack him. And all he is now is just a bunch of ashes. And why? Because of you! Enough! <laughs> What's the matter, Buckman? I'm burning in here! Oh! It's hot! He's speaking the truth. I didn't know anyone was up there. I swear. As I walked away from the building, I heard this tapping. 
on the window upstairs. There was a man being burned alive up there. To this day, it haunts me. It kills me. Five hours. Walking is still in my jail. Rotation check. Tired of going round and round. Guess all I can do about it is just put up with it. Look at it as if we're all on this big carousel with iron bars. I remember taking my kids to this one carousel many years ago. Now they're probably all grown up. Got kids of their own to take there. You got kids? Yeah, I got kids. Two of them. What are the names? My boy is Oliver. My sweet baby girl is Tiffany. They're still just kids. And I'm stuck in here. I have got to get out. <laughs> there ain't no getting out of here. Even if I could, I wouldn't be able to see my babies again. See, uh, Last time I escaped, I went to go see him. You know, it was, it was different. Kids get tired of seeing their daddy taken away. All I have now is memories of them loving me. You know, you've escaped four times and you've been captured four times. Ever wonder if there's a reason for that? My face is plastered all over when I escape. Maybe instead of saying, could I get out of this jail, you should be saying, should I? Maybe if you'd done your time in the first place, you might have been out by now. Well, that's clearly working out so well for you, Tucker. Time. You need time to redeem yourself. Not for them to one day say, hey, you're free, but to, but to live with your actions. Great. First I got Pete here to annoy me, now you. talking about
damn problem, Jesus. Tuck, I, I'm, I just... Just want to escape? Be free at any cost? What for, huh? You ain't got a home to go to. You ain't got a family left. You wrecked that. Now you're going to wreck me for you. You had your chance. You had your shot over and over to get things right, but like the coward you are, you do that. If anyone's arm belongs in those bars, it's yours. You're right. You're right, if anyone's got hell to pay, it's me. I've been, I've been dodging punishment for way, way too long. I'm sick and tired of these sleepless nights, the restlessness and the guilt. What the hell are you doing? Myself. Do that. Uh, don't do that. That is not what I meant. Stop now. Stop. Tucker. Tucker, you're a good man. I hope to God I see you on the outside. Maybe I'll take my kids to that a carousel you spoke of. Maybe I'll see you there. You and your children's children. like that. Payback's coming to you, Buck. Yeah. 
Hey, come on, get over here. Get over here. Jesus. Come on. Get over here. Buckman. Doctor. Thank you. Your hospitality, Shay. I'm checking out. Redeem yourself.